Welcome to my creative lab. I'm Olga Valentina and I'm gonna cook for you. What's on the menu today? My birthday. And I needed some help, so I invited Jacques Zedenhoff, who's official partita tequila mixologist, and he's gonna help me to do so many cocktails. And he's from San Francisco. Thank so you. tell me what we're doing. All right, we're <laughs> gonna get uh, mixing with one of my favorite tequilas today. Yes. Um, Mine too, by the way. Yeah, great. Right. <laughs> So Jacques, tell me what we're gonna do first. What I'm gonna make you right now is a Southern Heat. Ooh. And I love to make this cocktail because it really shows how tequila stands up to spice. We're gonna have a little jalapeno in there today. So, I love spice. <laughs> great, and I hope you're ready for this cocktail. So we're oh. gonna take a little bit of cucumber. Okay. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm making two drinks. Obviously I need to make you a drink and myself a drink. <laughs> we're gonna take a couple slices of just a jalapeno skin. Mm -hmm. We want the drink to be spicy, but not be overwhelmingly so spicy. So no seeds. Yeah, exactly. So I'm gonna start off by adding two per drink. Ooh. So we're gonna do four in total. The nice thing about this is that you can make this drink um, extra spicy or just exactly how you would want it, right? Always a little bit of fresh lime juice. Mm -hmm. um, I think the lime juice or citrus or lemon or whatever it be has to always be fresh. Um, there's nothing more important than a, a yeah, fresh cocktail. Yeah, I don't like concentrates know? and all that. They always added sugar, all these preservatives. I think this freshness is always the best way to go. Always the best. It's just all that other rubbish just gives you a yeah. terrible hangover. Oh yeah. For sure. <laughs> and I don't like hangover at all. <laughs> Never. Um, and it's just as easy as just, you know, getting a, a hand juicer, juicer. Takes a few oh, seconds. Oh, actually, tell me, what is this? This is So this two is a, This is ounces. two ounces. Oh. So for the drink, it's going to be one ounce of fresh lime juice. Okay. We're making two. Okay. So we're going to add that. We need a little bit of moisture with the drink. Mm -hmm. And now, handy little muddler. And we're going to get in there and really just kind of well, you need to be strong up. for that. It's a good workout. <laughs> <laughs> so you're really getting in there, breaking all the ingredients. Oh my out. god, I see like a cucumber seeds, and it's all green and fresh, and it smells amazing. Exactly. Nothing like a fresh cocktail, huh? Yeah. Okay, so we got that all nicely muddled. Um, now we're gonna add some of the important ingredients. Just a little hint of sweetness. So I've got lovely agave nectar. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna do about half an ounce. It's about a quarter ounce per drink. Okay. So you're just adding to. Just, a just to brighten up that, yes. that citrus. We're gonna add a little orange liqueur. We want I that slight orange, orange sweetness. And two ounces, right? Uh, about a, so it's about three quarters of an ounce per cocktail, so okay. about an ounce and a half. Okay. And then my favorite part of this whole cocktail is obviously partita blanco. And we're gonna do about an ounce and a half per drink. Did I tell you that I made a cheesecake with that? I was lucky enough to mm. taste it actually, which is brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, so we've got all these lovely ingredients wow. in, in there right now. Mm. For Partita Blanco. Mm -hmm. And then obviously we need to add a bit of ice. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm a professional bar, you know. Never done anything that professionally. <laughs> oh, no, you know what? It's professional, but you should have fun with it. Right? Yes. Make sure that shake is nicely sealed. Mm -hmm. We want to get in there, shake this up, liven up the drink, and really get it going. So. <laughs> all right. So we got the drink all ready to go over here. I do like to, as you do in cooking. You know, mm -hmm. Never trust a chef who doesn't taste. Never trust a bartender that doesn't right? taste. Right? I always say, taste it. Yes? Beautiful. You just want to make sure that you got a little bit of spice, a little bit of citrus, okay. a little bit of sweetness, right? <laughs> so we got that drink there. We're going to go ahead and prepare our glasses. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. For you. I'm so ready. <laughs> this is going to make my birthday really fresh and spicy. We're gonna straighten this out. Mm -hmm. Just right in. Wow, look at the colors. All that beautiful cucumber. Yes. The green from the jalapeno. And... All right, mm -hmm. we got that. But obviously we want to garnish it to make the drink look great. You know, obviously cucumber is part of the concept itself. Yes. So we want to get some of that nicely in there like that. Oh, wow. I always said the decoration is always important. Exactly. We drink Plating, the Plating, yes, eyes, yes, right? yes. And there we go. That is the Southern Heat. I can't wait to try it. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> well, cheers. Think. Cheers. Happy birthday, by the way. Thank you for coming. Oh, my gosh. 
Okay, bye. <laughs> mm. Wow. Yum. It's spicy and it's not too spicy. Right. And it's not too sour and it's not too sweet. It's like all the balanced combination. That's gonna be a perfect start for my birthday. <laughs> So I see you prepared a shaker for me. Is that mean that I'm cooking? You have to help me. I feel like I'm doing all the work. <laughs> well, now I know his birthday's on 20th too. So you'll be both Leos. Like, then I'm cooking for you now. Like, no, what is it? Mixing? Mixing. I'm you cooking all the time. I'm doing <laughs> What's the name of this one? Okay, so this is a cherry rosemary crush. So again, we're gonna utilize fresh ingredients, uh, some cool things that you can get at the, at the market, uh, some herbs, and obviously tequila, because I feel like tequila is really versatile when it comes to making cocktails. I mean tequila. <laughs> so, but now this time, I okay. made you the cocktail last time, so now you gotta do a little bit of your own work, right? I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> okay, as always, we're gonna start with a little bit of fresh citrus, just to get a little bit of that okay. acid. Okay. Again, we're just gonna squeeze that. So very easy. I'm gonna give you a little lime juice in there. These little things are, I wanna have those too. Yeah. And I mean, these jiggers are wonderful and I just like the idea of, you know, when it comes to citrus and measuring that out, it really, it mm -hmm. really helps with the balancing of the drink. Oh. So we got a little bit of lime juice in here. We're gonna take a little bit of fresh rosemary. You know, I use a lot of rosemary in my cooking. Yeah. This is like one of the ingredients that I would use meat. I would never thought of the cocktail. <laughs> Rosemary, sage, jalapenos, all those lovely kind of spicy herbs really work well. Great cocktail. Again, we're gonna take the metal. Mm -hmm. We want to just kind of get in there, not really break up the rosemary, but just mm -hmm. get some of that lovely essence out into the cocktail. So I'm gonna do that to you so you can get there. Give it a good muddle. <laughs> Good exercise. Yeah, I feel I need some. <laughs> okay, now a wonderful addition you can have to your cocktails is just getting some fruit preserves, marmalade, jams, whatever that may yeah, be. instead of sugar. Exactly. So you get a little bit of sweet, a little bit of tart cherry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this one's obviously obviously a cherry preserves. Mm -hmm. um, it's just a nice way of adding some. Uh, interesting okay, I'm gonna go to take a toast for, <laughs> for a cherry preserve. <laughs> this is kind of a breakfast cocktail. Okay, so we're gonna take a couple of our spoons. We're gonna put it right in there. So this is like a teaspoon as a for the cooking measurements. Yeah, or exactly. What is it? Okay. That's about yeah, it's about a teaspoon. Also. Okay. So we've got a couple of spoons, mm -hmm. and lovely rich. Um, I would just like the preserve. <laughs> lovely. And then we're gonna have obviously back to potato okay. tequila, um, and we're gonna do a nice mm -hmm. and three quarters. So measure that. Nothing wrong with a good measurement of tequila. Nothing good. <laughs> Nothing bad. Nothing bad. Okay, so we've got that in there. We've got the tequila, we've got the mm -hmm. lime juice, we've got the rosemary. Mm -hmm. I just like to um, just get things mm -hmm. mixing up there a little bit. Oh, the color is gorgeous. Yeah, the color is going to be beautiful. Look nice and red, a little mm -hmm. bit of rosemary, everything's mm -hmm. kind of mixed in there very nicely. So we got that. Obviously, an important feature, we've got that a little bit of ice. I have my home style shaker here. <laughs> Should I close that? it? In one second. Okay. okay. Yes. Got some ice for myself. Okay. Make it up Our lovely highball glasses. One for you over there. And there we go. Always oh, nice to just finish it off with fresh ice. Okay, so okay. I'm gonna put my shaker, get that one locked in there. I'm gonna get yours. And boom, that's locked. And now it's locked. turn around. And we wanna shake, right? Live and the cocktail. Yeah. There we go. Okay, so Ooh. that should pour the lovely. There, you got yours going. I'm gonna taste just quickly, just make sure we've, we've got a good thing going here. Yes, Excellent. we do. <laughs> yes. And I, I have a little up. strainer here. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and. Wow, look at the colors. Lovely color, right? Give yours a little bit of a shake, get the rest in there. There we go, every good <laughs> drop. <laughs> Squeeze! <laughs> and then lastly, so now we got uh, cherry, rosemary, a little bit of citrus, mm -hmm. and we're gonna finish it off with a little bit of ginger beer. So that little Ooh. bit of the ginger spice, right? I'm gonna go ahead and pull that right in there. 
ね。あ、そう、you added it after。Yeah。you don't。kind of don't。yeah you lose this gazy。exactly you want you want the bubbles in there you don't want to shake、okay. it out of the drink right。yes。and then just to make sure just put、uh, mm-hmm. most of it in there、mm-hmm. and again for garnish。Do drink with the ice again. Get that lovely rosemary in there. And this, what you do, you release the oil, right? Just kind of liven it up and、uh-huh. like wake it up a little bit. Wake up. There we go. So I think by the end of the show, I'm going to be drunk. But cheers. Drunk but happy. <laughs> cheers to Leo's. Yes. Wow. That could be a drink for.、Um, I don't know, a dinner like、uh, meats, and you know, you see all this juiciness meat, and then you have this cocktail freshen up after. Yeah, it's a lovely drink. I'm already preparing the menu for my birthday party, <laughs> including cocktails. <laughs> so, what is the next one? And I guess the last one, right? The last one. <laughs> But the best one.、Um, so, this is the La Perla.、Uh, And、uh, this is a drink I created with Partita Reposado. It's got a little bit of that age on the tequila.、Mm-hmm, it's been、mm-hmm. aged in、uh, oak barrels.、Um, and when I thought about this drink, I thought about Spain. The idea of like an aperitivo cocktail, something、oh, that、yes. you have right before dinner, really get your guests excited and happy, right? right? Exactly.、Yes. So we're gonna start off with a little bit of a sweet base. So、uh, pear liqueur. Oh, it's a pear liqueur. Right.、Wow. We're gonna start with that. Just gonna, but it's, a, it's only gonna be a hint to add that flavor of pear.、Mm-hmm. Uh, it's gonna be three quarters of an ounce、mm-hmm. pear liqueur. Can I smell? Yes, it's lovely. Wow, it's、And、like a schnapps. A little bit. It's got that kind of pear <laughs> sweetness, but it's、yeah. delicious. Next, we're gonna do a fino sherry,、um, that beautiful Spanish dry sherry that's gonna add the kind of dryness like when you expect a martini or a negroni、mm-hmm, or something、mm-hmm, like that.、Mm-hmm. Um, And obviously, a, a nut to Spain. So, an ounce and a half of Pinot Sherry. You're introducing me to so many different alcohol. That's really, really dangerous. But in a good way. <laughs>、um, and the lovely thing about Sherry, just like tequila, I think it's one of the great kind of spirits、mm-hmm. or the wines that you、um, can have with food. So,、oh, when、yeah. you're having your dinners and you're making these drinks, they all pair really well、and、with food. And it makes you hungry. <laughs> exactly. We want to be hungry when we eat that's, food. Yes,、right? that's what exactly we need. <laughs> All right, then partido reposado.、Mm-hmm. We're gonna do the same amount, an ounce and a half.、Mm-hmm. I like the color already. It's, yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. We've got your lovely wine glasses chilling here so far.、Mm-hmm. Um, you can have a martini glass, a beautiful、mm-hmm. wine glass. You can even do it in a champagne flute.、Mm-hmm. Um, right now, we want to add dice. Now, normally, like you would do a martini or Manhattan,、mm-hmm. we would add the ice and we would stir that drink. But we're going to try something a little bit different. You've got to be game with this, right?、Um, <laughs> we're going to do it. There's a famous bar in Spain, Bubadas,、okay. and they pour their martinis this way.、Mm-hmm. It's kind of a way of stretching the drink and adding a little bit of aeration to it. I don't know what you're doing right here, but <laughs> show me that. <laughs> It's going to be a nice way of、uh, impressing your guests. It's a nice way to impress your guests. That's like all the cooking is back. <laughs> okay. okay. Space for a drink, right? You got your lovely strainer in there. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna step back.、Mm-hmm. Two things. We're gonna pour it in here. In ice. Then we're gonna step back and then we'll pour like this. So like, what you don't want to do is do this because you're gonna clean up afterwards.、Right? Okay. okay. We don't want to waste your time. Okay. So, a couple of steps. So it goes right in there. You see、mm-hmm. it going over the ice, which、mm-hmm. is lovely. Are you sure you want me to try that? Of course. <laughs> I can do it. You can do it, right? Just, just contain the. Oh my god. All right. Are you ready? No. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Easy. Okay, I put the strainer back. Just think of it like you're sauteing Jesus something. Jesus Christ. There we go. You got that.、Okay. Nice and slow. Go to Russia. Woo. All in. All right. Now you go. I think it was half, half of it out. Okay, I'm gonna put it in.、Oh, I'm so nervous. No, don't be nervous. My fingers sweat. It's <laughs> like drinking champagne. It's easy. And now, pour it. Pour it. Here we go. Blow that. See? <laughs> One more time, then. Excellent. Okay,、Pour、I'm sweaty、out. now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna remove 
the ice. Because okay. we want to chill our glass. You can either keep that in the, the freezer or oh, the refrigerator. Oh, so it's refrigerator. chilled glass. You want it nice wow. and chilled. Remember, cold liquid, cold chill. We've got our liquid in there. It's nicely chilled, nicely iced down. Yeah. Um, Glass. And mm -hmm. this is going to be lovely too because this is a delicate cocktail, it's an aperitivo cocktail. Mm -hmm. The aromas are going to come up like you would drink, um, mm -hmm. like you would drink wine, mm -hmm. you know, sherry, you got the oh, yes. masato. Now lastly we want to add a little extra brightness to it. We're going to um, take our potato peeler mm -hmm. and we're just going to get a nice strip of lemon or zest. Mm -hmm. Get you to do the same. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and get that all that lovely lemon aroma into the glass. Beautiful, like a pro. And into there, you want to crack and it in. And you do like this? Yep, squeeze it in. All those, those I saw the oils. Yeah. And there we go. Now, cheers, I guess. Okay, cheers. <laughs> See what you think. Thank you. Wow. So a little bit of pear, a little bit of sherry, a little bit of I even sardo. see the um, lemon oils in there. Wow. Mm. Mm. This is pretty strong. A little bit strong, but it'll make your guests happy. I know. <laughs> I love it. Perfect. <laughs> thank you so much. Right, thank you. Jacques, thank you so much for coming all the way from San Francisco. And thank you for amazing cocktails made with Fertina Tequila. And you're invited to my birthday party. I will be there, thank you. Thank you. Priyatnova Appetita.